within a matter of minutes. Well, I was talking to one of my favorite tenants, residents, apartment renters of the building I live here in, in my apartment on Capitol Hill in Seattle. A large man walks in, goes through a small space to my right, instead of going the other way around me where there's much more distance, not wearing a mask. I hear sounds, I move over and make sure my jujitsu doesn't disrupt those who are so busy and intelligent. Doors close, open. A small dog stares at me all of the sudden. They leave, more people come in a group. Two women go upstairs who stare and stare in an office where a building called Caroline W. Apartments has staff to assist those residents who need their support, who have a title and professional accreditation as SSH, Supportive Housing. There were awareness sounds and echoes, lots of speed, confusion and misdirection, and long stares. Young women with older men, a young woman with an older man. In all directions. Within a matter of minutes. During a spontaneous time. Chosen to inquire if a landlord was working in an office today now. And then lastly, a face staring into glass and a hand slowly knocking on a door. They said they forgot their keys. The woman I often have conversations with who sits on a couch by a door and appears older and less aware, though intelligent, concentrated and focused and with good attention now, who said they knew who that was and I let them in and they went up and then returned down to the floor called one, walked over, said they locked their keys in their apartment now and had to wait for the staff, the landlord, to help them enter their apartment now. And faster than what I described happening in time, anyone who's intellectually restricted, controlled, limited, who has difficulty, but usually gets called smart, can solve what just happened with a person who said they got locked in their apartment. With an apartment, you have to lock with a key different than a traditional metal object. And unless there's a locking of a door, there's no second key for a significant other gender neutral partner. 
boyfriend, girlfriend, wife, mistress, lover. Leaving only one option, no locked apartment, or keys lost in a world outside of an apartment building now. Conclusion, what appears random and coincidental, unfortunately, mostly has to do with those who are always running from someone following them, doing and not appreciating those who stand in their way and their dominance now. There's drugs involved. There's humans who want their meth and no one watching. Who want their cannabis. Break from their routine and practice of science fiction novels now. And then there are those most emotionally who have conversations not about some system someone made called folk psychology with these processes they call words, but a human to human interaction and no misdirection and confusion, no disarray caused by observing and watching a system observing and watching them now. When humans observe and watch and see and hear a system, they've agreed to live within those services they're receiving are less beneficial, more restricting and controlling and limiting and disrupting for those with disabilities and difficulties and cancer diagnoses and recoveries from those troubles. who understand and appreciate awareness, not as a routine, a decision, solving a problem of drug distribution, dominance to have sex with women and fuck girls and gender neutral partners, but a renter in a city where there's less economics, less businesses, less applications to submit than there are drug dealers and gangs and mafia cartels driving their cars back and forth, playing their loud music and brandishing their guns and their knives wearing their colors of their shirts and their styles and their hats, crooked and backwards and straight, where their aim, their direction, and their requirements are more intense and worse than living in China and Russia and North Korea and Iran under a Sharia law, a Mao law, a no Tibetan Buddhist law and ethnic diversity plan for inclusion for the Muslims from Uyghur concentration camps. 
where dogs are food. Kim Jong-un has superpowers, nuclear weapons, and a button. called Control and Limits, Echoes, Distractions, Hallucinations, Paranoia, Color Mood, and Awareness Women Use to Stay Safe and Secure, and Men Practice to Dominate Those Who Stimulate Them and reward their safety and security they provide during a coronavirus pandemic. In a world civilization, they fled as exiles, escaping those followers and those observers of those behaviors, of those police, of those firemen who aren't similar to them, socialist and communist and violent and a duality of time and consciousness now.